Hi everyone, welcome back. Today we are in Sims 4 again doing another cast here, but today I am doing country living outfits only. So just using the pack to create looks. Um, as normally when a pack comes out, I kind of just like go through every swatch and then kind of just make one outfit out of it. Where I actually wanted to like go through and make multiple looks with the clothing that's in the pack. Um, so yeah, only using those items uh, for makeup though, I do use base game, um, but it is only country living and base game, basically, for the whole, for every single outfit. Um, so yeah, uh, I do try to make good outfits, I'm not trying to use every single item, um, just trying to use, trying to make looks out of the items that we have and then making them as best as I can. Um, as you know, some of the items that come with packs are ugly, so I don't want to use those. Some of the hairs, especially, especially I can't speak, especially. Um, some of them are just not good, so I try to avoid those and go for um, just the hairs that I actually like. Um, so, yeah. Um, for the first look, I did a black jacket. Kind of, and jeans combo, very dark look. Where for the second look, I did this lilac purple kind of outfit. It's not very country. I mean, it has a little bit of that vibe, but like the first look is very much more of the country living aesthetic. Where the second one isn't really, but I didn't want to do like all the same. So I thought it was like, you know, I don't want them all to be. I know it's a country living pack, but I don't want them all to just look like farm girls, you know? So that was what I was trying to avoid. Um, so I did a mix match of kind of different styles, but all oh, just using the same pack. For the sec third look, sorry though, I went for this blue crop top with this pink skirt. As there was pink on the flowers, so I thought they kind of connected. Better with some pink shoes from that um, pack as well. And then went for a brimmed hat, um, I think for this one, yeah. And then just, um, again, it's a country living hairstyle. Um, with just some sand accessories and earrings from the pack as well. Then went in with some base game makeup. And I don't think there's any makeup that comes with this pack, or else I can't remember if there was, so I just took to base game makeup. Um, and then went from there. Um, for this next look, I did this white skirt, this long white skirt here. And then I ended up using the same top as I did for the last look. Um, but going for a white swatch just because it worked the best. A white, no, black swatch. I can't even remember. I could just because it worked the best um, with what I was wanting to do. Yeah, I went for a black swatch and it was this black skirt. Um, just because it like lined up how I wanted to with the skirt. Um, it's a very long skirt, so it was kind of hard to find something that fit perfectly with it. Um, I went for some black wedges um, and dark nails. Um, then just went for um, this here, um, just an updo braid. Um, went for some dark makeup as well, as it is quite a dark look. Paired it with some pearls and some white earrings. And yeah. That's that one done. Moving on to look number five now though. Um, went for this white and beige top jacket combo. Because it was some white shorts from Country Living. Cottage, is it Country? Am I saying Country? Is it Cottage Living? I think I'm getting... I feel like I've been calling it Country Living. I think it's Cottage Living. Oopsie. <laughs> um, oh, correct. Let me just double check that. Actually, never mind. Um, here is. Um, I think it is cottage living. Wow, that's bad of me. Um, but yeah, just went for this jacket combo white outfit for that one. Moving on to look number six, though, we've got this blue sweater, which I thought was quite nice. Um, I did it with some white shorts, some different white shorts. This is two options. I made sure to use a different one. Um, and then, yeah, just went for white. I quite like the white and this blue colour together. That was quite nice. Um, paired it with some white shoes as well. Oh, sorry, not white, blue shoes. 
and then some white nails um, and then for here just went for this hair that has the blue headband in it um, was thinking about doing a hat um, ended up doing um, a broom tag again um, it was blue and kind of matched the blue from the sweater and went for this bob instead um, then went for some glasses um, I wasn't going to do a necklace so yeah uh, for the last two looks though I did um, one piece outfits so that um, to show the variety for those so I'd only be doing this top and pants collections so for starters I did um, I think I did a dress for the first one um, yeah I went for this green dress um, as I thought it kind of worked paired it with some beige shoes um, because there was kind of beigey flowers on it so kind of not really beige um, I mean it, it kind of it just worked I feel like with the green um, but it was some flower bracelet um, I was gonna do tights but I thought the tights were a bit much with the flower pattern on it so for the dress so just lift it um, and then some big sunflower earrings just a necklace um, base game green eyeshadow going with the green on the dress and yeah for the final look though I think I did um, some overalls if I can remember um, which I thought were quite cute um, so yeah the, just went for these overalls here and went for like a black kind of look with it um, but that's about it really though so I'm gonna write it up here um, thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed this video um, let me know and I will see you guys again soon with another one. Bye. Thank you.